Good day ladies and gentlemen, I am Weezeek, and welcome to the Amazing World of Skyrim. This is the second episode of our Let's Play series. If you haven't watched the first episode, make sure you go see that now. Uh, this series follows the amazing adventures of our amazing character, Hod Towered. Did I see yeah, we're just going to talk to Fendel first. Thanks. Make sure we can get him as a follower. We can you use him to abuse like archer levels out of him need. later on. Could you, could you right, he tells us to go talk to Camilla, and Camilla completely roasts Sven, which... Respect for that, to be honest. Now, we're gonna bring the quest in, and now we're finished the quest, so we can actually have him as our follower. A good trick with Fendel is that you can actually abuse archery levels out of him, as long as you have money. And guess what I have? Money. And we... I don't know how many levels we get specifically, but we can just take the gold out of his inventory after we buy stuff from him. So, yeah, pretty cheaty, but, ah, who cares. Right? And so we just go to a tower and just get, or just kill everybody there, steal all their stuff for selling purposes later on. It, yeah, I, I like money. Um, yeah. We kill someone, make them fall downstairs, sort of, and then we head over to Bleak Falls Barrow to get the Dragonstone. Why am I getting the Dragonstone before going to Red One? That's a good question. That person just killed him. Interesting. But we are going to get the dragon before we go to right run so we can save a bit of time, right? I'm just gonna go through upgrading my bow slowly and make my way inside of Bleak Falls Barrow. I cleared out the first room no problem and then I just want to show this fight because why not? I need to show some energy in there, right? I solved the puzzle which is Snake Snake Dolphin. And apparently I have a troubled time doing that. I activate the lever and I make my way into the next area, which is going to be a boss fight because why not? Am I right? Okay. After the boss fight, we uh, let someone out of webbing, which we are going to kill right after because why not? Am I right? Once we let him down and cut him down, uh, we shoot him with a bow to kill him. Uh, yeah. He just ran away and took the arrows like a tank, but you know, no one can escape me because I am amazing. We take the Golden Claw of his inventory, and we go down to where the Golden Claw goes into the keyhole. We press every circle thingy, I don't know what to call it, twice, and that will open the door, as long as you have the key. As You can also see where the key is on the bottom of the gold on the claw, because there's multiple claws in Skyrim. Which may be a video all of itself, I don't know. It's just, if you want to see that, comment down below. But after we unlock the door, we can get into the boss room. The boss room, so there's a weird wall where glowing letters start to come out at me and start putting weird wind effects onto me. I don't know why. I equipped the scroll of fireball and completely missed the fireball because I suck. Watch this, watch this amazing feat. Yeah, I missed. And then I did a little cheesy thing where I uh, may have or may not have stayed where the boss can't get me and shot him. But, you know, you didn't hear this from me. If you like this kind of content, please make sure to comment down below see, telling me what you want to see next, or liking or subscribing, whatever you think is best. Uh, I enjoy recording this type of content, so if you enjoy it too, please let me know. Uh, without further ado, I'm Weezig, and I'm signing off.